The water here is calm enough to bring in the boat. In Japan, water tosses boats like bathtub toys. While the panic and disaster is in a land far, far away. Hey, Mom, how are you doing? This story hits closer to home than you may know. My brothers and sisters, my mom, and my mom's side of the family. Sheriff Sergeant Richard Baumgarner has family in Hawaii. He got the 2.30 a.m. call from his little sister. On my island in Kona, Kailua Kona, on the big island, there was a um, road that was washed out. It's kind of the main drive. Baumgartner's family in Hawaii is okay. He has family in Japan, too. So does my friend, Marine Matt Lyman. He's stationed in Germany now. He got in touch with them the same way we got to him, through Facebook. He says his dad tells him the last quake in Camp Zama felt like a long rumble. We've got about 450 Marines from the Marine Expeditionary Force here. Marines are stationed on each of the seven continents around the world every day. Just so happens Marines from here at Camp Lejeune in our own backyard, well, they're near the epicenter of this disaster. Is there any chance that some of the Marines from Lejeune would be helping with humanitarian work? It's uh, still way too early in the game to determine what part, if any, you know, our Marines will have in, in those relief efforts. For now, we know Lejeune Marines are all accounted for. As for those here with families scattered across a disaster area. You take care, Anthony. Love you guys. They're accounted for, too. Bye. In Onslow County, Carly Swain, News Channel 12.